Hello, 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 Dirty Trucking, Dirty Truckers, 3.58 a.m. here in Detroit. I just walked in again. My phone has stopped alerting me from my surveillance system. And it's on. As you can see, it's on. My doorbell camera is on. This motherfucker's on. I'm standing right in front of it. I ain't got no alerts. This motherfucker is still in my phone. I did a factory data reset. And after I did a factory data reset, the only thing weird that happened to this phone was Uber did they update. And then all of a sudden, the up apps that I had on my phone all of a sudden needed updating. I just changed the password to my bank account. All of a sudden, that password didn't work. This motherfucker is still in this fucking phone. He turned the volume off on the Uber app. Now you didn't set the settings on my surveillance camera that I don't receive the alerts. I didn't touch anything on this phone. When I come home, when I get tired of it beeping my phone, when I'm sitting here, I cut it off from in here. Then turns it back on when I leave or sometimes I don't because it ain't catching nobody anyway. But the doorbell is constantly on. My alert from Google is not coming to my phone. That means somebody has went into the settings of the goddamn surveillance camera and turned it off, just like they did with the Uber app. All of a sudden, the guidance was talking, and then it wasn't. Somebody toggled it off. I didn't turn it off. One minute it was working, next minute it wasn't. And that ain't the first time that didn't happen. I was driving, using the guidance with the Uber app, and noticed it stopped talking. Somebody is in this phone, and I'm talking to you directly, you fucking hacker-ass bitch. They're going to come kick your dough in. They're going to take all your shit. And I can't wait till they catch your motherfucking ass. You making too many dumb mistakes. You slipping up, bitch. Get the fuck out my goddamn phone. You stupid bitch. Coward ass motherfucker. Doing shit behind computers and shit. You coward ass bitch. Leave me the fuck alone. I don't know your ass, bitch. On some damn... Goddamn hacking ass shit. What the fuck you fucking with me for, bitch? I don't even know you. You all up in my motherfucking shit. I can't come in there and fuck your shit up. I ain't in there hacking in your shit. I ain't up in your fucking bank accounts. I ain't taking shit out your fucking apartment. I ain't cutting your camera off. But you all up in my motherfucking shit. These bitches waiting for me to barbecue tomorrow so they can come up here. They was already in the car asking, you going to have people over? Not you, bitch. No. I said no, and no don't mean yes. But according to them people, they think no means yes. Or they don't give a damn what you tell them. They think they got the right to do whatever the fuck they want to. I be downstairs barbecuing. They coming in here putting seasonings and stuff I already seasoned. Switching canned goods like they did last barbecue. Motherfucker, your ass gonna get caught. See, the only way they, the only reason they getting away with this shit is because I live alone. There's nobody in this apartment when I walk out of here. And you, who, what, what? It fuck is wrong with a motherfucker sitting up there hacking into a camera 
of somebody they don't even fucking know. And if you do know my ass, again, I'm going to say it again. What the fuck is wrong with somebody sitting up there in some closet somewhere and where hacking into somebody up goddamn camera? You sitting up here watching me, bitch? You want you see that? Is you watching me, bitch? Is you watching me, bitch? One of these days they're gonna catch your ass. One of these days you're gonna do this shit to somebody that's real tech savvy. And they're gonna find out how you've been able to cut their goddamn camera off. And one day you're gonna think it's off, bitch. And they're gonna be recording your ass from somewhere else while you thinking the camera off while you up in they shit. And your fucking ass about to be busted. Cause I'm tired of your motherfucking ass. Come cutting my shit off through my fucking phone. The camera is on. They are cutting my shit off through the fucking phone. That shit is illegal. And I don't need to be talking about need a new phone. I don't need no new phone. I need to find out who these dumb motherfuckers is. Press charges against their ass. Have their ass fucking locked up. That's what the fuck I need to do. Because these motherfuckers don't understand no. They don't understand to stay out of motherfucking shit they don't belong to you. They don't understand. Don't be fucking with motherfuckers. Don't want you fucking with their ass. They don't understand that shit. They think they can go around here doing whatever the fuck they want to. Coming in my apartment, eating my shit, fucking with shit, taking shit. And they still doing the shit. I haven't touched anything with my surveillance camera. So why is it not? Beeping the phone. They did that with my other system I had in here. When I had that wise camera in here. Somebody had set the settings for the motherfucker not to notify of any movement at late hours of night. That's when they was coming, creeping up and down the fucking hallway. It's either somebody in this building. The husband is somebody in this building. I, I know one of them is a female. Because one of your blonde strands of hair was laying on top of my stove when I came in here one day. Your blonde hair was laying on the top of my fucking stove. And it was a long hair strand. So the hair was from a long haired blonde bitch. I should have took it and bagged it. And let them run the damn DNA on it. Get a sample. Find out who your ass is, bitch. A long, and I made a video about it. A long strand of hair. No, was it brown or like a golden brown? Because I think the video, in the video I sat at the table. And I placed it on something so you can see the color of the hair. And I told you it wasn't my hair. I made a video about the shit. It was a long strand of hair, and it had to come from a white female. That's one of the individuals coming in here. I don't know who hacking into the camera, but there was a long strand of hair that didn't belong to me one day, a while back, laying across my motherfucking stove. That mean that bitch been in my kitchen, and it wasn't inspection time. It wasn't no reason for them to be in here. They like to come in here. They like to put notices on the door talking about it's inspection time. You may be selected. But then when I sit here all day, they don't never show up for the inspection. Then all of a sudden when I leave out, that's when they sneak in here and shit. Now, it's been times I've been here when they do an inspection, but I've been noticing that. With your little inspection notes. Talking about you may be selected. What the fuck is they talking about? Be selected. These bitches is coming in my apartment. Going in my fucking food. Going in my refrigerator. They going in everything. And moving ain't going to stop the shit. They just start the shit all over again at the new damn place. They get a new group of individuals playing the same role as these stupid bitches here. That's coming through my fucking front door. I'm standing here talking, moving, and my phone still ain't beep yet. That means somebody has cut the damn surveillance notification 
toggle button off through the phone. I didn't do that shit. Stay out of here, bitch. And everywhere else I live, you better stay the fuck out of my shit. They think because I live alone, that's why they that's why they ain't been caught. See, if I had a house full, your ass would be too scared to come here, bitch. Because a motherfucker that was up in here catch your ass in here, ain't shit you gonna be able to say. But ah, I get off me. I'm sorry. The only reason you not hollering now is because I live alone, bitch. And I ain't found my way to catch your motherfucking ass coming in my shit. It's coming. Trust me. It's coming. 